Ladies and gentlemen, this next bout is an elimination boxing bout scheduled for three two-minute rounds in the bantamweight division. Out of the red corner, Jaquan Robinson. Back to boxing we go. Welcoming to the cage, Mr. Jaquan Robinson. Out of the blue corner, Brian Paradis. Mr. Brian Paradis making his way to the K, or excuse me, the ring now. More boxing action in front of us, fight fans. Vaseline being applied ringside. Has to be done in front of the commission. Make sure they do that within the rules. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this bout is scheduled for three two-minute rounds in elimination boxing in the bantamweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the red corner. He is a boxer standing six foot one inches tall with Warriors Academy out of Denver, Colorado, Jaquan Robinson! <laughs> fighting out of the blue corner, Standing five foot ten and a half inches tall with House of Pain East out of Denver, Colorado, Brian Paradise! Mr. Brian Paredes wears the blue tape facing off against Jaqueline Robinson. Representing the Warriors Academy, he's wearing the red tape. House of Pain East, represented by Mr. Paredes. <clears throat> Three two-minute rounds. Body head immediately shown by Paredes. Robinson staggered in his footwork a little bit. Oh, and takes a hard left hand as Robinson. Paredes immediately looks to be the more accurate of the two. Very wide stance with his feet by Robinson. See if they rule that a knockdown. And a knockdown it is. Thought it looked like possibly he could have just been tangled up in his footwork, but referee deems that it was the effect of a punch that put Mr. Paredes down. So <clears throat> Paredes with some catching up to do here. And again going down is Paredes, but pops right back up. So that one was ruled as a slip. Paredes, good left hand. Paredes finding accuracy with his head punches, but Robinson landing some nice power shots and pushing Paredes back. Now Robinson goes to work with the combination. Paredes not quite having the accuracy here at the end of the round as he did early on. Oh, there it is. As I was speaking about it, he proved me wrong.
Both fighters with a good pace and it shows a little bit. You can see they've taken some deep breaths. A lot of UFC talent in the crowd here this evening. I'm looking across at Drew Dober, recent UFC win for him, and bumped into Dustin Jacoby earlier on. He's got a bout coming up, I believe, April 15th. So the fighters are the fans. All right, round two, three two-minute rounds here. Paredes on the receiving end of a knockdown in round number one. So round one goes to Robinson. Robinson swinging hard for that one. Paredes able to see it coming and evaded nicely. Robinson does a nice job on his combinations, getting his body and his hips winding up and adding to the power of his punches, not just arm punching. You can see it when he lands. He has solid effect. Paredes on the receiving end of a hard shot there, and his mouthpiece goes flying because of it. All right, mouthpiece reinserted back to action we go. Reinserted. <laughs> Again, the accuracy of Paredes jacks around the head of Robinson. Robinson, however, takes it well, seems to be able to answer back with power. Long jab by Robinson finds his target nicely. Robinson, the longer, taller fighter, but sort of negates his advantage by way of taking that really splayed out long stance. Lowers himself down, takes away some of his height and reach advantage. Both fighters able to hurt each other here in the second round. Robinson's hands very low at the end of the round. Draping his arms over the ropes in his corner is Robinson. He's looking very tired there. and Certainly good reason behind that for the kind of output that he's had, as well as being on the receiving end of some shots like we talked about earlier, just taking a punch is really a drain on your energy. Checking it out here on the replay. Both fighters able to find accuracy with their strikes. Paredes comes over the top with a nice right hand after ducking under the attack of Robinson. Whistle is sounded to get these fighters to touch some gloves to start off this third round. And See how this plays out. Away we go. Corner of Paredes asking him to jab his way in. Nice job attacking the body by Robinson. First one was blocked by the elbows of Paredes, doing a nice job keeping his guard in place. Oh, and a good overhand right by Paredes. Had Robinson snapping his head back, looking up at the seedling lights for a second. Corner of Paredes imploring him to pressure forward. Corner of Paredes calling for the hook and he gives it to him and then covers nicely. It's Paredes 
burn a little energy just hitting his arms. I think the fatigue starting to show on Paredes. Corner of Paredes calling for increased output. Robinson's corner wanting more action from their fighter as well. Paredes going to the body. I think that's wise target selection at this point in the fight. Take even a little more energy out of your opponent. Oh, and a crushing overhand right as the 10 second clacker sounds for Paredes. Robinson relegated to covering up here at the end of the round. Entertaining fight. Boy, the judges are earning their money this evening. This guy's having to put in the work tonight. Sportsmanship by these guys. Nice hug there, some hands up, and checking out the replay here, the energy of Robinson visibly draining as the round continued on in the third, and even as he walked over to his corner, kind of draped himself over the ropes to catch his breath, and I think that might have done it for Paredes, conditioning the fact that he was able to continue to pressure forward, good and solid in his footwork, and put together some nice combinations to uh, end out the bout. <clears throat> Getting the fighters into the center. And wait for Mr. Josh Stewart to make his way into the ring. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards. All three judges score this bout 28-28. This fight is declared a draw. All right, well, evenly matched fighting. It shows on the judges' scorecards 28-28. These guys go home with the draw on their record. Kind of smiles all around because, well, nobody lost. <laughs> 